Hey, hey, hey. I hope you guys are having a terrific Tuesday. It's your favorite remote work enthusiast, Delilah, and I'm back with another hot work from home opportunity. And this comes from a new to this channel company called Restorix Health. They have a help desk position available. It only requires a minimum of one year experience and is a mix of answering emails, chats, and phone calls. So this isn't a non-phone job, okay? The phone is involved, but it's not the only mode of communication that you will have. And this is great for people who are kind of tech savvy. You know, you're going to be handling some technical questions and, you know, sort of like IT things. But again, it only requires requires one year of similar experience. So a lot of people will qualify for this and I'm excited to get into all of the details. Plus it's gonna pay pretty good. So first things first, please make sure you hit that subscribe button and you tap the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of these hot work from home opportunities that I share every single weekday. That is all we talk about on this channel, remote work and what's going on with it. So we would love for you to join our community. And once you take care of that business by locking it in, then we will be ready to jump in. Okay, so like I said, this is a new to this channel company, Restorix Health. They offer wound care. So like I said, this is a new to this channel company. This company is called Restorix Health and they are in wound care management. When I was checking out their Glassdoor account, it says that they are a leader in the development and management of turnkey comprehensive wound healing and amputation prevention centers. So that is awesome. And they have a minimum 1,001 employees, which to me is a lot of people. So this is a pretty big company and they have a really nice rating. I know they don't have a lot of reviews, but from what I read, it sounds like people for the most part enjoy working there. Now, Restorix Health has a help desk analyst position that is virtual and it looks to be available US wide. Their other remote opportunities specify specific locations but this one says virtual. So it looks to be available, you know, all over the US at minimum. And this opportunity from what I could find on their glass store should pay about $20 per hour, which is about $800 per week. And they didn't have this specific role listed, but they had something called an instant service agent position that kind of sounded like maybe that's this. And then they also had another position for their front desk coordinator, kind of different different, but it also was along that range. And $20 per hour is what that breaks down to. So I believe this would pay at minimum 20. This is technical and usually technical based roles tend to be on the higher end. So I wouldn't be surprised if it paid more, but we'll be conservative. So jumping on in, it says primary responsibilities, monitor and respond quickly and effectively to request receive through the IT help desk, respond to customer queries in person, phone, email, the ticketing system, or remote support. This is virtual, so you wouldn't be able to do it in person. Creation of step-by-step -step training materials with screenshots for clients, provide technical assistance and support for incoming issues related to system, software, hardware, document internal procedures, maintain daily performance of computer systems, ask educated questions, and listen to customers to determine root cause of issues, work through the problem-solving process with employees, empower them to do the same, run diagnostic problems to resolve problems, clean up computers, accessories, and other equipment, escalate significant and recurring issues to the tier two support team, resolve technical problems with local area networks, wide area networks, and other systems, collect feedback to determine patterns and issues such that they can be resolved or FAQs can be provided to customer to ease in troubleshooting, additional responsibilities, maintain a neat and clean clean workspace, desk area, cable management, basic knowledge with printer maintenance and troubleshooting, education and technical skills, high school degree or equivalent, at least one year minimum in an office environment, ability to diagnose and resolve basic computer technical issues, problem solving and troubleshooting skills, excellent communication skills, keen attention to detail, 
memory of patterns and interest in problem solving, preferred BS, BA, and IT computer science or related fields, preferred proven experience as a help desk technician or other customer service role, experience with office applications, Office 365, troubleshooting Windows client server operating systems, Windows 7, 10, Windows Server 2003, 2008, 2012. And then it says physical requirements. This position requires periods of time in which sitting, standing, crawling under workstations, lift up to 50 pounds, clean printers and desktops with the use of provided PPE. And so it says the above is intended to describe the general content and requirements for the performance of this job. It is not construed as an exhaustive statement of duties, responsibilities, or requirements or may change at any time. All qualified applicants will receive consideration for employment without regard to race, ethnicity, color, religion, sex, gender identity, sexual orientation, national origin, disability, or protected veteran status. Restorics Health is an equal opportunity employer. And that is the lead. So we know what preferred means, okay? It's nice to have that, but you don't have to have that. You do need to have your high school diploma, at least one year minimum in an office environment, and the ability to diagnose basic computer technical issues. So this is for someone who is tech savvy. Now you don't have to be tech savvy to the point of, you know, you can take apart a computer and rebuild it, but you do need to know your way around technology. And I will also give you guys my two cents on this because I've done a lot of hiring for positions like this. I never really talk about, you know, that part of my career in these videos, but I actually have a whole separate thing where I hire for other people's businesses. And my niche is kind of like in the tech world, which is how I even got into my own resume and cover letter software. I won't bore you guys with the details, but when it comes to jobs like these, being able to type clearly and being able to answer technical questions in a non-technical way are very important. It goes a whole long way. And whenever you're, you know, dealing with someone who's having like tech issues, they're already frustrated they're already ready to like throw the computer or whatever piece of technology out the window and you have to be able to explain to them in a very easy to understand way what it is that they need to do to accomplish what they're trying to accomplish so you have to be clear when you're typing you have to be able to put it in the most simplistic way possible and then if there are recurring questions you also want to be able to create articles that help people who have those same questions answer those questions. So it's a lot of just sort of talking people through the process, but instead of talking, a lot of typing. Now they do mention phone use. So I'm not sure how much phone use is involved, but typically with a help desk, the majority of your communication is through a support ticketing system. So that's my advice there, okay? You just wanna make sure that you can express that you have the ability to do that on your application and the apply now button is at the bottom but wait there's more if you are looking for a work from home job then you definitely want to watch my ready to work from home workshop because i talk about all the things that you need to know to make your job search as easy as possible as productive and as successful as possible so there are a lot of things that when you're getting ready to look for a, a remote job or even if you've already been doing it for a while if you would know those things you would be able to tailor your job search and be a little bit more effective a lot more effective so i talk about equipment i talk about your home office i talk about resumes job scams i really go over a lot of those preliminary work from home topics in this workshop. It's basically my way of answering you guys' most common questions in a very like centralized place. So all you have to do is put in your name and email, register, and a workshop starts every 15 minutes. It's on demand, no matter what time it is, you can sign up and a workshop will start within the next 15 minutes. So make sure you register and watch that 40 minute free workshop. And then when you are done with the workshop and you're fired up and you're ready to get all these applications in, head over to my website, remoteworklife.co and put up, uh, and the mega list of jobs is your one-stop shop resource for companies that hire you to work from home. 
home. You can search the mega list of jobs. So let's say, for example, you're interested in something tech based. You could type in tech and then you could scroll through companies that we have on here that are known to hire for technical jobs. Now, I will say every single company offers some type of technical job, but there are some companies that, you know, they specialize just in tech. So you could really find tech work at even a healthcare company because there's always the back end and the computer systems and whatnot. But even if tech isn't your thing, there are so many companies on this list, 446 to be exact, you can find something that works for you and you can find it in the area that you're looking for. So definitely come here, bookmark this page. We're always updating it in the direct links to these companies' careers pages this year. So there you guys have it. That is the hot lead. Go ahead and get your application in ASAP and don't forget to check out the ready to work from home workshop and the mega list of jobs. And with that stated, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this was helpful and I will talk to you soon. Bye.